Here's example two on evaluating functions. We have f of x is equal to 7x plus 2. Find f of x when x is 0 and when x is equal to 1. So let's do when x is 0 first. When x is 0, I'm going to take the function f of x equals 7x plus 2. And anywhere there's an x, I'm going to substitute for 0. So f of 0 is equal to 7 times 0 plus 2. And that equals 0 plus 2 because 7 times 0 is 0 and that equals 2. So f of 0 is equal to 2. Now let's do for x equal to 1. When x is equal to 1, we take the function f of x is equal to 7x plus 2. Anywhere there's an x, I'm going to substitute x equal to 1. So f of 1 is equal to 7 times 1 plus 2. That equals 7 plus 2, which equals 9. So f of 1 is equal to 9. And if you remember the illustration in the previous video where we visualized the function as a machine, where inside this machine I have the function and this machine receives inputs, which are your x values, and it spits out your outputs, which are your f of x's, okay? So in this case, uh, an x equal to 0 comes inside the machine. This machine will change that 0, and you get a 2 as your output. And if x is equal to 1, then x is your input. x equal to 1 would be your input. The 1 comes in here. It gets changed into a 9. And then a 9 would pop out. OK? So there you have it. Go over these again. Try the practice problems in your book. And I'll see you in class.